Hey everybody, Michael Schultz here, and I just want to very quickly show you how to insert an image into a blog post or page. First off, you go into your WordPress blog, and under Posts or Pages, hit Add New. All right, And as you see, I've already got that open, and I've already got an article in here. And this article is about three common mistakes that affiliate marketers make. Okay, So what I did is I went to Flickr.com, and I found a oops picture. So just kind of grabbing the same concept of, I made a mistake. And so what we do is we right click the image, we hit view image, and you end up with this. All right. Now that's a little big for my post. So I'm actually going to download that, save it as oops.jpg on my desktop. All right, wait for that and close that and close that. Minimize. Clear list, close, and I'm going to open this with Photoshop so that I can resize it real fast. And I kind of want the image to be typically typically it's around maybe 250 pixels by 250. So I'm going to do that and I'm going to save it as the same file name on the desktop. It'll refresh here. Okay, so now we have this oops image on our desktop. From here, it's not much harder. All we need to do is we need to select where we want it to be. I want it to be next to the word however and I want the text to wrap around the image with, with correct spacing. So I select next to the H, this little blinker here, and under upload slash insert, I click the little image icon right here, if you can see that. It'll bring up a dialog box and you click select files and you can actually upload the image from your computer onto your blog server and you can keep it up there as long as you want. So I'm going to double click oops.jpg. I'm actually going to do that again so that you can actually see it. I'm sorry. Double click oops.jpg. Okay. Now since I did that twice it uploaded it twice so ignore that but I'm just going to select oops.jpg which just was uploaded. Show. Okay now I've got this up here. Well, how do I put it in my post? Well, quite easily, right under here, you'll see title, caption, description, link URL, alignment, and size. I want to keep the full size because I've got the correct size right now. And I want to align it left so that the text will lap, wrap around it here, if you see that. And you can set your description and caption and stuff. I'm going to leave that alone right now. And all you need to do is select insert into post. Okay. Now you see that visual. Let me make this bigger for you so you can see it. You've got that image in there now. Okay. Now, what's the problem? What's the, what's the obvious mistake here? Well, the text is too close to the image. Uh, we have uh, enough uh, horizontal alignment up here and here, and so that means that the text is fine, but it's too close to the edge here. So what do you do? Well, you first select the image, and you'll see two icons appear. Click the little image icon right there. All right. And we see we see we can change the size right here very easily. We can change the alignment and all that. But we want to go into advanced settings up here. All right, so we have well more of our, our more advanced settings where you can manually add, change CSS class, size, all that. What we want to look for is uh, under image properties, we see border, vertical space, and horizontal space. As I said, the horizontal space is fine. However, the vertical space is, or I mean the vertical space is fine. The horizontal space is wrong. So what we want to do is we want to change the horizontal space. I'm saying that that looks about 10 pixels there. All right. So I'm going to change it, well, more like 15, but I'm going to change that to 10 pixels. I'm going to leave all this alone. You can add a border if you want. That's fine. Uh, I'm going to leave all this alone. You can mess with that on your own. But uh, here we go. We're going to update that. Now you see we have spacing in there now. Our horizontal spacing is fine. So that looks pretty good. I don't know about I don't know about you, but that, that looks pretty good. I, I like that. Okay. So I'm just going to go ahead and publish that onto my blog. Okay. Now we have the post published. It's all there. I'm going to view the post now. Okay. So I just set up this blog, so ignore the simplicity and all that. I haven't customized it at all yet, but as you can see, we have the the uh, title in there, we have the text in there, and we have the image in there, and it looks pretty cruddy. Uh, that gives you the basic idea. I'm going to troubleshoot it real fast, and I'm going to change the text to look right. And I think all I need to do for that is I need to select all of the text, and I need to hit Align left. All right. Update post. View post. Okay. So now now all that extra spacing and stuff is not there and it looks pretty good. So that's just basically how to put an image into a blog post or page. If you need any more help, reply, tweet me, whatever. You can see my Twitter, uh, my details at the bottom of this post or in the video description. So have a great day and enjoy.